Hello, hello. And welcome to an impromptu stream. Some incredible machine. Um, yeah, I thought we'd uh, do a do a stream uh, tonight out of our schedule. I'm uh, on holiday at the moment, so we're going to have a bit more a bit more free time to do some streams. So uh, I thought we'd check this one out. I just got this one from uh, GOG just the other day. We got quite a few games on special for their Christmas uh, Christmas sales. This is one I used to play when I was when I was a boy, so it's pretty cool. Um, I think there's like four that I have in the pack that you can get. This is like the original one, so we're gonna check this one out tonight. Do a little bit of this. I'm not sure how long the stream will be. Probably not super long, but um, I'll probably do a bit more of it in the days to come as well. Um, now I was trying to get this to run on a bigger screen because it doesn't really run that well in full screen. So I'm gonna have to play it in a tiny, tiny window for now. But maybe next time I'll see if I can get it working a bit better. But um, yeah, it's a pretty, pretty cool little game, puzzle game. You have like different uh, items that you can combine in like a Rube Goldberg, I think that's his name. A Rube Goldberg machine style thing. Seymour. Seymour, I'm not playing with you right now, bud. I'm in the middle of something. Sorry. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool little pretty cool little game. It has like I feel like it has a physics engine to it almost. Seymour! Shush. What are you doing? Um, yeah, you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean when we get into it. But it's pretty cool. Pretty neat. We will jump in. We'll have a look. Oh, it's like our window is not sized correctly. Oh, OGB. Welcome back. Is that really loud? Or is that just me? Thank you for the resub, OGB. Good to see you and Merry Christmas. Back. Okay, I'm gonna have to resize this. This looks a bit weird. Seymour, please, sir, be quiet. Uh, all right, what do we got? Oh, it seems it's being very loud. Merry Christmas, see it. It's going all right, thanks. It's going all right. So it's a little stretched, but I'm sure it's fine. It's almost like... Uh... Hmm, hold on. Let me just adjust this. I should have been a bit more prepared. So it's way stretched on here, so I'm going to make it a bit smaller. Alright, that looks better. Be quiet, please, game. You're being very loud. What's going on? Yeah, the new house is going pretty good. We've got lots to do. We haven't really... Well, we've done, we've done some bits and pieces, but... Um, yeah, still quite a bit to do. I mean, it's like... It's not like it's a dump or anything and we can't live in it, but... It's like... You know, it's totally fine to live in, but we obviously want to want to make it our own, which we're going to work on over time. Um, but yeah, it's going pretty good. Going pretty good overall. All right, we've got some copy protection. Select and order the three parts listed on page five of the user's manual. Just got one too. Oh, nice. Congratulations. Needs loads of renovation. Well, that's fine. I mean, it's all part of it. I feel like if you get something that needs renovations, it's like you can make it more your own. Like there was a lot of um, a lot of new built ones in our area, um, but we didn't like. Well, to be fair, like they're pretty they're pretty overpriced. Um, but to be fair, we probably wouldn't want to go for one of those anyway because it's like everything's done for you, but then it's not really like your own and I mean you could you could renovate it and make it your own but then it kind of defeats the purpose of getting one that's you know that's just been done up if that makes sense don't want to look up toilets and flooring and paints I want it to be <laughs> oh if only it was like the sims it would be so much easier we've got to like repaint all the rooms at some stage and it's going to be a bit of a mission if, if only it was as easy as the sims we could just like click a color onto a wall and it was done 
rather than having to like strip wallpaper, sand stuff, fill stuff, do undercoats and all that fun stuff. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna work on that over time. We're not in any hurry, so. All right, where's our manual? We need page five. What have we got? Page five has got. Is this page five? Or is this page six? Page five. Oh, it does have one. I see. So we want. Or is this page five? Hold on. Let's try this one. A pin, or a nail, whatever that is. A ball, eight ball, and a light bulb. All right. Oh, now it's all. Oh my god. Yeah. Hold on. Now it's all the wrong size again. So I did have it the right size. It just changes like resolution for the copyright protection, which is a bit weird. Okay, cool. I think we're good. Yes. Alright, this game is very tiny on my screen. I don't know if I can show you that. Actually, I probably can if I go to this. Oh, it's upside down. What? There we go. That's how tiny my screen is. It's upside down for some reason. But just ignore that. 60 year old. Is it 60? It's not 60 years old. I'm not that old. What is this? Like 19? Let's have a look, actually. I'm curious now. I want to guess like 80s. Sometime in the 80s. It was a DOS game, so. Um, where? 1993. Oh. Okay, 1993 was the original. It's actually more recent than I thought. Not 60, yeah. It is very tiny. I'm gonna have to mess around with the resolutions next time. Um, it's through DOSBox. I always have issues like, because it wants to run in full screen, but then I can't see my second monitor because it messes with the resolution of it. So it has to be in a window. So it's always an issue with old games, but. We'll figure that out next time. Say that so people feel old. Well, I already feel old. I already feel old. Okay, what do we got? Make the basketball go through the hoop. Um, volume. Interesting. Restart level. Quit. Gravity. I don't think we can... Yeah, we can't change these for the set puzzles yeah actually mm, I could do that maybe that's easier I can actually just uh, copy that window there we go good thinking it's actually way way easier the resolution looks a bit odd I'll deal with that it's all good. Okay. This plate. This one's probably super simple. We got ball we got bowling balls. We got little mouses on their wheels. Put those there. Boom. Bowling ball moves. Okay. Now okay. Should be pretty straightforward. Whoops. Go. Oh, we got a score too. For like speed. It's yeah. interesting. Interesting. Hello, Seymour. You're gonna come destroy everything as usual. Come sit down. Why do you do this? Every time. Every time you do this, you'll be like fast asleep on the couch. Just. Minding his own business, and then as soon as I get up to do a stream, he comes and thinks it's time to play. Climbs all over the desk. Come on, sit down. Alright, we got a password. We got passwords. I guess you can't save with this game. This is super old school. Alright, do you want to advance to the next puzzle or play your solution to this puzzle? 
Let's advance. Aren't we good? We got a funky soundtrack. Seymour, seriously, sir. Keep pushing the microphone. The microphone's already broken as it is. Alright. Put volleyballs into the middle baskets. You must place and flip the mouse cage. Yes. Makes sense. So that determines the direction that it goes in. So if we did it like this, it'll go the wrong way. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Phew. Oh yeah, I have a timer. I should maybe start that. I probably don't really need it for this game, but I'll get it going anyway. Alright, well, some pretty cool passwords. Dynamics. Sierra. Pop all the... You must. You must pop all the balloons. Alright. I wonder how many puzzles are in this one. Okay, so what do we got? We got wind stuff, a ball. I think these first puzzles are pretty simple because they're just like the tutorial ones basically. So we should be able to get through them pretty quick. Alright, I was to make the bowling ball fall off the bottom of the screen. We can do that. Okay, so we just do we just do those. I think we had we had this one when I was a kid, and we had I think the Incredible Machine two. But there's like four on this pack that I got, so there's going to be a lot. Um. I remember I could always do like these tutorial missions as a kid, but then as soon as I got to like the actual puzzles, I failed. <laughs> I think I could do some of them, but some of them were quite complex. Okay, boxing gloves to punch the baseball up to the metal pipes. Boxing, oh the baseball, okay this one. Alright, so we've got boxing gloves. We'll put a, put a thing here to flip it. And it will roll down. We want to box it. Uh, we want to fill up this one. That will roll down. Go. Total bonus points, 293. I wonder if it records your score with these passwords. I guess it probably does. Okay. Make Mort the Mouse run in his cage by hitting the cage with the basketball. Alright. So, this is going to be a pain. I'm going to, like, bounce it all the way over there. That's not going to work. That failed miserably. Oh, oh missed. Okay. Almost. Um, maybe higher. Maybe like lower and more across. Come on. Yes. Seymour. Please sir, sit down. Seymour has a ritual of he climbs on the desk. He climbs off the desk. He climbs back on the desk. Pushes the microphone. Climbs back off the desk. Climbs back on the desk. About five times before he'll sit down. Make the jack in the box break the fishbowl of Bob the fish. Poor Bob the fish, what did he ever do? He never hurt anyone. Okay, so 
that gets that running. So we probably want to put one here. Alright, and then one about here. That should do us. A bull! We've got King, ZZ8, C, Scoom. Alright, all you need to do is pop the balloon. Note that you must flip the windmill to select which direction it turns. Okay. Pop the. So we basically just need to turn this gear on, right? Okay, so windmill. Belt. Ah. This mouse sensitivity is very weird. Maybe I can drop it down. Oh, that's too. That's too. Oh. Okay. Flip. Flip. Uh. I want another one. The belt. And then one of these. Yeah! Dragon! The dragon. The dragon password. Okay. Goal is to lower all three buckets. To do this, you must cut both ropes with the scissors. Let's do it. Um. So, scissors. Ball. This one's gonna bounce, so we're gonna trampoline. Go. Yeah. Is that it? Oh wait, does it have to hit the ground? Didn't say that. It said cut the rope. Hmm. Okay. Must be where it registers so if we've passed it or not as if it's on there. Okay, you must shoot all three guns. We only have, oh, we have a gun here, I see. Okay. This one's already set to shoot. Um, we can put a bucket here. Sure, we can put a bucket here. Uh, and then we can put a rope here because this bucket will push, will push that seesaw. Yeah. Okay, base, baseball. I'm not going to remember these passwords, it's fine. I can just check the vault if I, if I really need them. Uh, it goes to turn all the fans. You must flip the light switch to provide power to the electric plug. The initial state of all plugs is off. Okay, so I want to hit this. And I guess we hit that one with the balloon. So if we do that. Oops. I'm not sure how many puzzles are in this one. Can't remember how far I got when I played this as a kid. Probably not super far. Wait, what was the goal? Make the tennis ball fall down into the pipe hole. Generators will take turning motion and provide electricity. The electric motor must be plugged in to run. Okay, so... Ooh, windmill. Right, what do we want to do here? We want to push this somehow. Can we use a fan to do that? We need to power the fan. So maybe we need one of those. And a belt. Okay. And then we need this ball to hit this. So... 
does this thing do? How's this thing work? Plugs in. Uh, wait, we... No, no, stop. Right click goes to that menu, apparently. Um, we probably want to power this, right? And then this will power this. Seems a very long-winded way to get this to power. Flip. Yeah. Phew. Fish. All right. Advance. Okie dokie. The goal is to make all the gears on the screen turn. Shining light on the solar panel will make the electric plug active. Whoa. I don't remember these. Maybe I never got this far. This is not very far, so I must have got stuck pretty early. These don't look familiar, though. Okay, so wait. What are we doing? Make all the gears on screen turn. Okay. Well, I guess we want to hook them up. This is plugs in here, so we need to turn on this light. Somehow, probably with this bucket. Maybe this to here. This needs a fan. So we need something to put light onto this one. So we've got a torch. If you work backwards, it simplifies it a lot. Okay, that one goes there. Conveyor. Yes! Phew. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, lighting a fuse. Goal is to fire all the cannons. You will need to flip one of the magnifying glasses so the light is focused correctly. Uh, yeah, the magnifying glasses are always a pain because if you have them around the wrong way, they don't work. And it's you don't really know which way they're supposed to be. I guess it'll be the opposite way than that one is. This one's all very simple. It's a very loud cannon noise. Not a very pleasant noise either. Okay, all you need to do is fire the cannon. Great. Um, ooh, we have dynamite. Some amazing explosion sound effects here. Oh, we probably want this. And then some more dynamite, I guess. Uh, and then one of these. Oh, what? Okay, maybe we need it more this way. It's better. Oh. Phew. Yeah, we did it. It's weird that their passwords have like a normal word in the front and then just all these numbers and letters because it's almost like they've done this so it's easy to remember, but then you need to remember this bit anyway. So it's not really that easy to remember. You must light the candle. Where's the candle? Yeah. Um, alright, so we want this, this. Um I guess we're gonna need the ball. Uh wait, maybe we need is there a balloon here? Let's just see what happens. Ok, 
Okay, so we probably need... Pops the balloon. Is that what we want? Hmm. I thought we'd have the balloon. Oh, maybe not. Oh, we've got a poly. So maybe if we, uh... Do we even need this rocket? I feel like we don't even need this rocket. We can just do this. Ah, oh, we missed. What? Yeah. Whoa. Island. I feel like these passwords have no connection to the puzzles at all. Goals to push both plungers down and set off the dynamite. Make sure you explode all dynamite that's on the play field. Alright, so we've got to get all the dynamite. Can we use the gun to shoot the dynamite? Can we just put some more dynamite in here? Let's rig it up. Why can't I turn this? Hey. Okay, we're good. Good to go. Kind of. This one's gonna go off automatically, so. Probably want this here. Boom! Yeah! Word! Word. Okay. Big brain! We're not to the big brain yet. I'm curious how hard these are going to get, because it's like... I remember them being tricky as a kid, but... Well, they're probably not that tricky. Uh, mold the mouse safely to the mouse hole in the bottom right part of the screen. Where's the mouse hole? Broken fishbowl will attract Pokey the cat. Is this the mouse hole? I guess this is the mouse hole. Did you play? Did you play this one as a kid, OGB? Or did you play like the newer ones? I I played this one and I played the Incredible Machine Two were the ones I played as a kid. I think the second one has like way more like bits and pieces you can use for the puzzles. Played that one a lot. Was small boy? Yeah, same. <laughs> yeah, small boy, small brain, I was the same. I used to just get stuck. I think I used to just mess around in like the free free play mode more than anything. <laughs> small brain still. I'm sure that's not true. I'm sure you could finish it now. It's alright, we can do it together. Our small brains combined. So it's gonna break. He's gonna come over. Start that. Get scared to there. Whoa! What is that noise? That is a very high-pitched cat noise. It sounds almost like a Pokemon sound from like original Pokemon. Bang! There was a lot of animal cruelty in this game. Now that I think about it. Smashing fishes' homes, hitting cats with bowling balls, terrorizing mice. Oh, we got monkeys. Goal is to make both monkeys ride their bicycles. I remember the monkeys. I don't remember those solar panel ones though. This is gonna hit them on the head. Are they gonna make them run? Oh shit, okay. He's already running. Oh, because he's. wait. Ah, uh, he saw the banana. He saw the banana. Alright, so we want a rocket here. We want a light bulb here. A rope. Uh, and a rope. 
That should be all we need. This game is struggling with everything that's going on. Maybe I need to up the cycles. Do I have a shortcut for that? I don't remember. What is the default shortcut for cycles? I forget. I always forget. Let me have a quick look, because I feel like this is, <laughs> this is struggling. Control F12, is that right? Control F12, we'll try that. Okay, let's go 12,000 cycles. Hopefully that's a little better. Our computer's struggling. Wait, what are we doing? Basketball must cross all the gaps. To solve this puzzle, you must connect two of the teeter totters with a rope passing through the pulleys. You must also stretch an incline smaller to fill in one of the gaps. That sounds very confusing. Okay, so we probably want to close this gap. Put one of these here. Maybe that way. Uh, oh, I see. So we want to pull this one down. Maybe? Yeah. There we go. Here. Got it. 404. Bonus points not found. Alright. Make the ball climb the hill and knock Puggy the Cat off the cliff. <laughs> to solve this puzzle, you need to place the mouse cages so that the ball rolls over them. See, these ones, they just they basically tell you what you got to do. Alright, well, we just copy what's there. Very straightforward. It's coming for your pokey, watch out. Oh, poor pokey. He's always being tortured. Uh, pop any three of the four balloons. The gears that are turning will pop any balloons that come into contact with them. So wait, three of the four? Three of the four. What about, what are we going to do? All of them. Okay, he's running. We can attach gears. We can attach him to gears, right? Okay, we can pull this one down. Go there. And we just have two more. To get him running. Hmm. I guess we could pop this one. Simply. <gasps> Dodged. Oh no, we we need that one, don't we? So that's not that's not a good idea. Um. Can we get this? I feel like we can't get this one running. Can we reach that one to here? I feel like it's too far. It's too far. Oh, wait. I know. I know what to do. I went the wrong way. Oh, we need to... T uh, I see. I see. We need to change the direction of the gears. It's getting complicated now. Yes. I wonder if it's possible to do all four. Probably is somehow. We ain't got time for that, though. Goal is to make three baseballs, but none of the tennis balls go into the container on the right. Okay, so none of the tennis balls. Well, so we're going to just shoot them very accurately somehow. Seems very tricky. 
Um, okay, so we want a rope here. We want a rope. So we're just going to have to move these around. Oh, man. I almost fluked that. Which one do we need to move? We need to move this one. Maybe up. Oh. Oof. Almost. Okay, this one here is like... close. That's not going to work. Two. Where does that one go? This one here is the issue. Yes. He did it. Let any of the balloons pop. Okay, well, it's just a rope then, isn't it? Easy. Easy. What are these hooks for? Just to confuse us, I guess. Alright, pop the two rightmost balloons. The two rightmost balloons. Well, this one's gonna. Okay, we can just put a ball here. Deal with that one. What if we just tie them together? Nope. Um. What if we do that? No. This one to swing in here. Ah, oh, almost. Come on, balloon. I believe in you. Maybe this isn't the best way to do it. Maybe. these ones. We only really need one though, so if we put one here. Okay, I need to make the ball, the bowling ball, drop down into the cave. I'm assuming this is the cave. Uh, what? How the hell are we gonna do that? And put something here? This? Oh, that's too big. It's not gonna reach it though. Maybe we need to put it against it. We can't. Oh, whoa, what the? Okay, we have heaps of stuff. Um, what do we want to use? We'll probably want a gun, I guess. We can't put a gun in here. We can put a gun here. Anything else that can help? Not really. What if we just do... Let's see if this is gonna fire. Okay, 
We need to move the buckets, though. Somehow. Um... Maybe if we we got two ropes, we do have two ropes. It's gonna work. Not gonna light not gonna light it now. Maybe we need... Maybe we need another one down here. So we need to time it differently. Um... Falls the wrong way though. Can we block it or something? Go into the bucket. Almost. What if we put a ramp here? Oh, it's close. Probably don't need this bowling ball. We can probably just use the bucket. Yeah. Log home. Good log home. What are we up to? 27. Pop all three balloons. Note that you are on the moon. We're on the moon. I guess our gravity's different then. Oh, they fall. Okay. So how does that work with the tennis balls? They still fall too. Um. Okay. Wait, what? So we're not going to be able to use the gears then. Will they bounce on here? Let's have a look. Okay. Well. Okay. So we can get that one. These ones we need to maybe shoot one. Oh, okay, that worked. That was a bit of a fluke, but it should just be this one. Come on, you can do it. Yes. Graphics. Graphics. Okay. Let's put one baseball in each of the middle pipe containers. I wonder what 
what ear pressure does. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, one in each container. So if we did this, is that going to go in? Yes. Okay, so we just need to set these up, I guess. Seems pretty straightforward. But I could be wrong. Yeah. Easy. Nuth. Nuth. Weighing the situation. Make the baseball fall off the bottom of the screen. Okay, there's the baseball. Hmm. So we're going to want to do this. It does nothing. If we drop a ball in there. Let's it go down to this one. Then we need a ball in here to weigh it down more. Oh, that works. Okay. Now we need to do these ones. This one's going to be trickier because they're different weights. So we'll want this one in there immediately and then maybe from here. Oh no, that's too heavy. From the top. Yeah. Donald. Goes to pop both balloons. Pop of the balloons. We've got to mess with the cat again. What are we going to do? Roll a bowling ball at him? we got more stuff. We do. Maybe a ramp. But Okay, well this isn't fall to his death this time. Um... What can we do with these? We can pull something? We can pull the blind with this? Somehow? We don't have any pulleys though. Oh, sorry, we don't have any, uh... Yeah, we don't have any pulleys. I won't work this way, will it? That cat sounds crazy. How are we going to get this balloon? We need to like move it over somehow. Maybe if we do this. Oh wait, I thought we had a mouse thing. Hmm. hmm. Okay, this isn't as simple as I thought. What if we do this? Will that work? Oh. Yes. Okay, so we've got the monkey moving. Uh, connect that to there. Connect this to here. Oh, wrong way. We probably need another one in here. Is that gonna work? Oh, almost. Oh, so close. Come on. God damn it. We can't go lower, can we? Maybe like that. Oh, 
Come on, balloon! Move this. No, it's gonna be too low if we move it down. Hmm. Maybe like that? Yes! Compact disc! Good old compact disc. Put away the basketballs. Put all the basketballs into the wooden container on the right side of the screen. We shall do that. Um, okay, so... How shall we do this? This is too simple, this is not going to be the solution. Oh no! I need this one to like hit it, but then bounce. Shaver Lake. Good old Shaver Lake. Oh, let's just shoot all five guns. Alright, how are we going to do this? We have a ball. So we can cut. Oh, we have a lot of scissors. So that's going to do something. That's going to hit this. Which will pull this one. Maybe pull this one somehow. Oh, boom! Okay, maybe this one. Excellent. All right. Cut that one. Same setup. So it releases that balloon, so then that balloon can just do that. That's probably not on the right angle though. Didn't even do anything. Hmm. We're learning some words on this game. This is educational. What in the hell is that mess? Pop the balloon. What? Pop the balloon? Oh my god. Okay. Let's just see what happens. Not a lot. We have a switch. Um, okay. Alright, well, let's just work backwards. It's always the best thing to do. The balloon is going to get stuck there. So maybe we need to put a gear here. Attach there. So we need to turn this on. So we probably need to launch this ball onto this torch. So this needs to turn on. This needs to turn on somehow. 
how do we, what do we attach this to? Oh, they can reach all over there? Okay. I feel like in the later game they can't reach that far. Okay, so we need to get this running somehow. Why is there a switch here? We've got a fan. Ah. Oh, I see. Okay, so the. That'll hit this and light this candle. Uh, we can't have the gear here though, because we probably need the gear here, so we can get this moving. Alright. The ball doesn't go on there, we need to move this. No! Where does it need to be? Not there. Gonna be like it's been the exact spot to work. Oh, it's so close. I can't really go anywhere else. Oh. oh, it's too far away now. Come on, ball. You can do it. What are you going in there for? What? Now it's just hitting the side. Oh, it's so close. Okay, well... Hmm... Actually, that's not going to work, because we need to light this before this starts moving. Why do, why do we need to move this, actually? Actually, we probably don't need to do that. We probably need to use the rocket. Um, probably need to use the rocket to pop the balloon. Unless we just do... No, that's not going to work. I feel like they set these up specifically so you can only do it one way. Oops. Okay, well this needs to move to like... Whoa, this is lagging a lot. What the hell? Game's too much for it. Wait, I can't attach this. It's too far away. Whoops. It's weird. I keep right clicking to cancel, but it's not cancel. Can it go there? That's probably too... Well, why can't I attach to this? Hmm... I can attach to there? that move, so then we can get these gears moving. Okay, well that should work, we just need to get this tennis ball to land in the right place. Damn tennis ball, where are we supposed to put this fan? Why does it do that now? It's not even, the fan isn't even on it. 
Pain isn't even interacting with it. So close. Oh, look at that lag. Lagging like crazy. It's almost there. It's almost. Oh. No. Come on. Oh my god. <laughs> so close. Am I doing something wrong? That's it. That's it. Ah! Oh, so it's too short. <laughs> Slightly too slow. God damn it. Be here all bloody day. It's a stupid fan. This is the only thing that you can plug in here, so it has to be this. Oh, it's not even plugged in now. I've still got a belt thing left. Oh, we don't need, need that last belt. Okay, it doesn't get it at all there. That way it just ruins everything. cycles up a bit more but it doesn't seem to be does not seem to be helping I must get the jack-in-the-box to spring up easy easy so this goes here right we've got an egg tray oh, sorry, we've got lots of stuff we've got a light bulb Okay, maybe a fan here, and plug it into this, and get a bulb, get a rope, goes off the screen, which does not help us. This fan is too powerful. Maybe this over here. Bang. Ah. Oh. No, come on. What if we turn it? Could work if we do this. Okay, that gets him running. So then we go gears. Gears. No. Uh, keep right clicking. Right. Should be good. We got this. Easy. Easy peasy. What are we up to? 35. I think we're past the uh, tutorial once now. Put the ball and ball into the middle basket. Alright, we got a ramp. Sounds like someone walking in high heels when that goes down the ramp. Okay, so we 
add some of that. Maybe put a trampoline here. Oh, oh. Okay, maybe another one here. There's lots of trampolines. This is my plan. I think that ramp I put there doesn't actually do anything. Oh, another round? No. Um, what can we do to help this? Maybe a ramp here. Just to help push it in. could be put. I don't know the balloons aren't helpful. Maybe we need to adjust the trampolines. Hmm. Or maybe we just do this. Is that gonna clear it? That's probably not gonna clear it. Maybe a smaller one. Small ramp. Mm, maybe the ramp needs to come over here somewhere. This goes up into here, right? Maybe if we... Do this... Maybe this one's a clue. Give it a bit of a smoother... Mm. Okay, so we can't move that trampoline. It has to land on that one where it is. We can't move that one either. jump. I feel like that's worse. Maybe if we make this smaller. Oh, that kind of works. Almost skipped that one entirely. I don't know if that's the intended way, but... Mm. Mm, maybe not. It's still gonna fall short. Damn it. Maybe one down here? Can't really go any lower than that. Seahorse, I don't think the seahorse. Seesaw, not seahorse. I don't think the seesaw is gonna help. Okay, this is not working. We need to. the trajectory right. I think it needs to land differently somehow. I'm not sure how but that doesn't work. 
to kind of like roll. And that's this. because it needs, it needs to get onto this one. Do need the balloon. The balloon's actually kind of useless though, because we don't even have like a rope to attach it to anything. Come on, bowling ball, you can do it. I believe in you. Damn it. Um, can we reset this somehow? See what happens from the beginning. So it lands there. Reset dial. It's too late. I already touched it. It's okay. We're gonna figure this out. Oh, that was kind of good. That might work. Mm, maybe not. Maybe not. We still have another ramp, actually. Ow! Oh, Ow! Oh, it was so cl so close! Come on! No, oh, don't go back! Yes! Phew. Ha! Disc! Ah, oh, we lost all that. I don't think we got any bonus points for that one. It says we got bonus points, but I feel like we were on that one forever. What the fuck is <laughs> oh, the bowling balls? Yeah. Polish them balls. Holy moly. Stop the shootout between Pokey the Cat and Bob the Fish. You must let both guns fire, but you can't let the bullets hit Bob or Pokey. And they've had enough of each other. All this all this uh, stuff going on, hitting each other with bowling balls. I've had enough. So he's, okay, so we need the balls. We need the guns to fire. I imagine. We don't want to cut the rope, or do we want to cut the rope? Maybe we want to time cutting the rope like. Exactly. That's not gonna work. Oh, we killed Bob. We killed Bob. Block it. Oh, okay. We did it. I should drop the bowling ball on Seymour. We can't do that. Seymour, where are you? Hey, listen. Don't listen to that. Seymour would not react the same way as Pokey. I can tell you that right now. B 
be very flat. Send Mort to his house, on the bottom left part of the screen. What colour is Seymour? Seymour's black. He's a black cat. Yeah, he's black. I don't know if I have, I don't have a photo of him handy, but... He is black. He's pure black. Except for his one white whisker that he has. This is like his rival. Where we used to live, there was a white cat that lived across the road, and it was Seymour's arch enemy. It would always come to our house, and like, we were friendly with it. And like, it would sometimes even come inside the house, and like, it would let us pat it. But then as soon as Seymour saw that cat, it was on. He chased that thing for miles. He did not like that cat. But he did have a, he did have a friend a cat friend that was a black and white cat so it was like almost like because they were in the middle in terms of their coloring he was he was okay with that cat don't see a lot of yeah well there was actually there was at least two near where we used to live there was that one and there was another one which didn't have ears um because uh white cats are very susceptible to like skin cancer Especially on their ears, so I think that one may have got, like, cancer in its ears, so they had to take take its ears off. But that one was pretty friendly too. Sometimes it feels like cats get along better with other animals. And yeah, maybe. I think you could be right. I think they get territorial, so it's a big part of it. Seymour was definitely that way. We've seen a few cats around where we are now, but I haven't seen them interact with them yet. Although one did used to come to like sit outside the window at night time and just stare at Seymour and he'd like start crying and then I'd like come in to see what's going on and then look out the window and there's this, this, this freaky cat just, <laughs> just staring at us outside. It's a demon cat. I haven't seen that cat for a while yet though. Okay, what do we oh, we get to get, get the mouse in there? Okay. So a fan. We're gonna blow the mouse over that way. Go! Holy holy Jesus. You get stuck on the stuck on the ramp though. Hmm. What else we got? We've got another ramp. Eaten. Go, Mousy, go. Run! Damn it. I need to give him a head start. Go. Go, go, go. Oh, he's stuck. Okay, that's not gonna work. He's only motivated, motivated by fear, this mouse. Okay, so we can get him to there. Gonna, oh, I see. Maybe this one, and then this one. This plug in? No. We need to run this one, and then run a fan. Oh, wait, we need to plug. Plug the fan in there. Maybe that. Yeah! Quaternion. Right. We're doing good. We're doing good. You must put the bowling ball inside of the brick walls. Okay, well I can see where we're gonna go with this. We probably want this in here. We want something to get this moving, probably this windmill, this, this funky music, has there been different music for every level? 
like the house. Trampoline. Oh, this is all we have, okay. Do we want the bowling ball to fall into that area? Ooh, it's not gonna make it, okay. Maybe not. Maybe that will work. Not quite that smooth, but get there in the end. Almost. Just a few more trampolines. We should be good. Oh, it's gone the wrong way. You can do it, Wally Ball. Yes. Aquarium. Aquarium. Alright, trap Pokey the Cat. You must trap Pokey the Cat in the cage. You must also make the cannonball go in the bucket. Whoa, so it's like two puzzles in one. Okay, well, we're gonna have to cut the string, the rope. We're gonna have to move him, though. Somehow, how are we gonna do that? Drop. Oh wait, the bowling boys to go in here, right? No, the cannon boys to go in there. Thunk. You gonna go in there? Come on. Come on, Pokey. Oh, he doesn't want to go in. I don't blame him. Maybe a ramp. Gotta, we gotta motivate him somehow. Alright, he's in the cage. Part one solved. Now for part two. Um, cannon. First step. How are we going to launch this? Torch. Rocket. Hmm. Maybe we need to bounce. Go! Go, Bucky, go! We get the cannonball in there first. Somehow. Can we aim this? Not really. Okay. How the hell are we gonna get this in here? Because if we get the cannonball in there first, it's gonna stop the cage coming down. So then maybe we can, uh. Almost. 
and we can like take our time in pokey in the right spot. Haven't. Okay, it has a hole in it. Faulty. Get in the bucket. Damn it. Holy shit, where did that go? Oh, come on. Alright, that's in there. Okay, that counts. So now... Maybe we can hit that with... Oh, but we can't light the rocket now, because... Hmm. Okay, that makes it more tricky. Can we hit the scissors with the cage? No. Okay, well that plan didn't work. Mm. Okay, so we're gonna have to time this pretty accurately. Confused about the rockets. Why do we have rockets? Maybe we could use a rocket? What if we put a rocket here? It's not quite enough. Go! Damn you, Pokey. Hmm, I don't think this is the way to do it. But we definitely need the bowling ball to move them. Too low. There's no other way we can light this. Uh, we use the tool, the rocket. Okay, we can use a rocket, so we don't need the bowling ball there. Should work. Now we just need to get it in the bucket. Oh, but then we need to cut. We need to cut the rope somehow, right? Oh shit. This bucket has a hole in it. This is not good. I guess we can cut the rope 
before the ball goes in. Somehow. And then roll it in. Oh, that timing. Okay, nice. We got shoe. Shoe is the password. All right. What is our time? I think maybe one or two more. We'll see how long this one takes me. Maybe two. And then I think that'll do for tonight. All right. Wait. What was, what was it? What was the goal? Make both basketballs fall into the brick hole, which I'm assuming is this area. Okay. Do we use this somehow? Who knows? What else have we got? We got oh, we got a lot of stuff. What we got TNT? Okay. Interesting. This one might take a while. I think this this is where we start. Mm. We have a light bulb. Have a solar thing. Uh, we have a pulley. Cool. Okay. Maybe we can just use a fan. Maybe we don't even need this conveyor. Oh, it's too much. What the hell? Why did that sound change? Okay, that didn't work. Okay, well that's one. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Uh, where would Betty's the fan on this one? What is going on with these sound effects? Hmm. Too bouncy. Can I put this here to stop it. This fan is on like rapid fire. Turbo mode. Oh. Uh. 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 Yes! Easy peasy. Okay, one more. We'll do one more. Maybe two more. You must help Pokey the Cat to find his way home to the house in the lower right corner of the screen. Alright, Pokey. I'm on your side this time, Pokey. You gotta get home. How about a mouse? Will you go after a mouse? You will. Okay, that moves you down one shelf. Two shelves. Actually, this is probably not what we want. We probably want a fish. Right, but we need to break it. Oh no, he likes the fish too. Okay. What? Chase him. Come on, Pokey. You gotta get home, Pokey. Hmm. How are we gonna break this? That's all we've got to work with. There's a there's a TNT here, but how do we move, how do we make this work? Maybe Pokey can trigger it. Whoa! Okay, Pokey just died. Pokey, don't need the don't need the mouse. Put the mouse here. <laughs> it's all right. He's, he lives. Look, he's okay. He's all good. Pokey's fine. Still a little singed. 
explode. Oh my lord, there's a lot of time dynamite, Jesus. Wait, so all we need to do is light this one, right? So we need to hit it with the bucket. We'll hit it with the bucket, we need to cut the string. We don't have anything to cut the string with, so we most likely need to get a cannonball into the bucket. So, this seems too straightforward. Surely this will not work. Okay, well, <coughs> it didn't work, but it's only because of that, I think. No. Why is this not working? Or am I lighting it the wrong way? We're going to light the other one. Oh, there we go. Kaboom! Easy. Okay, we'll do a few more. I thought we were going to get stuck on these ones too. Goal is to lower the bucket so that it is resting on the brick wall. Wait, so it's resting on the brick wall. On this wall? Okay. So... Wait, is our gravity different? No. Why is it balloon going down? Oh, because the bucket's pulling it, I see. Alright, what's the plan? We can't cut the string, so we need to probably pop the balloon. So... Can we pop the balloon with this? I think you can. From memory. So I'm gonna have to pull this somehow. Pull it with this. Is that gonna work? Maybe it's not gonna work. Maybe you need a different light source. Maybe you can't pop it with a magnifying glass. I thought you could. That was the thing. Um, we're gonna have to get this candle over here somehow then. How the hell are we gonna do that? It seems impossible. We don't have enough ramps. We do have a conveyor though. We have a lot of conveyors. Okay, so let's get rid of this crap. Alright, we've got a lot of gears though, so we should, in theory, be able to do this. going to be in the way of the candle though? That's going to be in the way of the candle. Alright, and then we need to get the conveyor moving. So there's going to have to be a delay. on. I don't know if we need those though. So this will move the ball. That way. Is this ours? No, it's not ours. Uh, maybe we need a ramp here. Okay, so 
that'll hit that, so... That'll hit that, we can use this to... Somehow get the gears working... Is working with this. Well, we don't need that though, do we? Because we could just do this. longer though. See, it's gonna... How are we gonna make this take longer? I guess if we do... no. Okay, this is doing literally nothing right now. Need a delay somehow. I'm gonna restart. This is very messy. Alright, so... We need to use this to start things. Um... We need this to light the candle first. So... So that's fine. get this moving somehow. We've forgotten the music. The music's intense. I feel like there's been a different track for like every level. It's pretty impressive. Okay, so that's going to get this ball moving. So we want this ball to somehow trigger the gears. Or do we need the ball? Maybe we don't even need this ball. Maybe we can... No. This gets this moving, but this doesn't do anything, does it? Doesn't, yeah, doesn't fit at all. I feel like some of them kind of fit, but not this one. Okay, we need to delay this somehow. I guess we could, uh... Maybe that'll work. That's not what I had intended at all, but... But it's not gonna have enough speed. It's gonna be the problem. Although, we could... Possibly. 
connect this to here. Uh, wait, we wanted to go the other way, right? Oh, now it's, now it's not going to work. No, 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 go back where you were. Uh, this gear? Okay, that pushes it down. And then we need... Oh, well, Jesus Christ, don't crash, please. That. This is not as intended, but... It's working. There we go. To buy more RAM, I know, right? Why is this being so terrible? I'm gonna have to mess up the DOS box settings, I think. It's not liking it. It's not liking the 15,000 cycles it's doing. Let's put the cycles up more. 20,000 cycles. Alright, one more. We're gonna do one more. I'm a little addicted to this, just to be fair. Make the tennis ball go over the net. What? Oh god, why did I say one more? This one looks like it's going to be a pain. Tennis ball over the net. How the hell are we going to do that? Blow it up. It's my first, my first thought. Or a rocket. Launch a rocket at it. Um, so we need to cut this. Probably with this. I guess we use a gun. This is a very convoluted way to push a tennis ball. Alright, so we're going to want to do that. Whoa, okay, that's that's too much. It's as small as it can go, alright. Oh. That works. This doesn't explode, I thought it exploded. Oh wait, maybe we do... That. <laughs> what? That's not what I wanted. Where did it go? It went to space. <laughs> What's going on? This is not how it's supposed to work. No, come on, what are you doing? Oh my god, please. That's not over the net. That's not what I had in mind. Maybe. That. Oh shit. <sighs> Almost. Oh, we got a trampoline though. Trampoline to the rescue. You can do it. You can do it, tennis ball. Ah, yes. Flange. The flangey. We've unlocked the flangey. Okay, well, that's probably going to be our password. I could just look at the VOD, but I'm going to write it down. You can be authentic and actually write a password down. Okay, flangey. I'm probably going to write it wrong and then it's not going to work. We'll see. Okay. Z E 5 Z 998 Q 1 H. Alright, cool. Well, biggest brain. I feel like I'm just like, you just got to fluke your way through some of these. This is the best way to do it. Alright, well, I think that'll be that'll be me for tonight. This is a good good chunk. What did we get up to? 
45, we're up to 45. It's, it's pretty good. I don't know how many there are. Should we have a little peek? Holy shit, okay. Maybe I shouldn't have had a peek. 160. Okay. These ones are red. We got a tutorial on level 88. And then we go to red. It's worrying. Yeah, red. Red seems scary. I wonder if you can skip to these ones. Can we just can we just click one? Oh, we can just play any level. Okay, well, we're not gonna do that. How do I get out of here? Help. Red ones for biggest. Well, hopefully our brain gets big enough once we reach those ones. I guess we'll find out. Um, but yeah, we'll do some more of this. I'm um, maybe maybe might do some more tomorrow night. We'll see how we go. Um, what is tomorrow? Win Wednesday. So day after tomorrow, we'll have horror stream, which we still haven't actually figured out what we're gonna play. Um, there was a kind of like a point and click, which seemed kind of cool, called the Cat Lady. That was also on special on GOG, and I did pick that up. And uh, which I haven't actually showed Morgan that one yet, but I think she'd kind of like it. So we might jump into that one on Thursday. Um, but yeah, maybe some more of this tomorrow, or maybe in the weekend. I still haven't actually figured out what we're playing next week. It's a Tuesday, yes. Well, I am on holiday at the moment, so I have more t more free time. So I thought we'd uh, we'd slip in some extra streams. And I've been wanting to wanting to play this one on stream since I had it. So yeah, so I thought we'd do some of this. There's like another three in the series after this, and I know they're kind of like, this one's the more basic one of them, I think, and then the other ones are a bit more like, you've got more stuff you can mess around with, so we maybe won't even do all the puzzles on this one. I might just like get as far as we can before we get like ridiculously stuck, and then maybe we'll check out the other one too. There's even a weeb one of this, really? I feel like there's probably a few like spin-off versions of this. It's a pretty cool concept. I think there was almost like a uh, what do you call it? What is the word I'm looking for? Like a spiritual successor to this series? I think I saw something about that, um, but I haven't checked it out. But yeah, we'll probably we'll probably play through play a bit of all of them. So here we go. Coropata is at the the weeb version. You could always check out the weeb version. Depends how much it costs though. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna finish up here anyway. Um, we'll do horror stream on Thursday. Probably the cat lady. That seems kind of cool. So point and click. It is uh, currently on special on GOG. There's a whole bunch of games on GOG at the moment that are on special. Oops. I might have just done. So yeah, we'll, we'll check that one out Thursday, I think. What is this image? Let me see. Ah. That looks kind of cool, actually. I like the pixel art. Hmm, I actually might check that out. That seems kind of cool. Could be, could be interesting. But um, yeah. We'll be back on Thursday with something horror, probably the cat lady. And then in the weekend, we'll... there is a poll. Do I have a link for that? I think that's the current poll. No, that's a different poll. There's a poll somewhere. Let me find that. Um, but we'll play whatever wins on the poll, which I think at the moment is between uh, Hitman, continuing the Hitman game we started. Where is that? Yeah, here it is. Uh, yeah, continuing the Hitman game. Or, what was the other one that was getting, getting close? Tomb Raider. The next Tomb Raider game. I did start playing that one too, and then, I don't know, I wasn't really in the mood for it, I think. So I only played like the first two or three levels. Uh, but we'll probably start from the beginning from that one if we end up playing that. 
but that will be the plan it'll be one of those i guess that we'll jump into um but yeah maybe some more of this tomorrow see how i'm feeling but uh thank you for dropping in rgb good to see you and thanks to anyone else who's watching and i will see you next time goodbye